So yeah, five unspent skill points. We are playing Vault Hunters. So, first thing, um, let's see. Something I really do want to get is this. Because then I can just, if I uh, sneak, I can make crops grow. So I'm learning that. That's a skill. And this makes it so I can vein mine blocks, which I will also take that. And dash makes it so I can dash. I'll get two of that one. So now, if the game... Oh, goodness. I thought I was over this. Um, I didn't mean to do that. Anyway, so now, if I click this button, I can dash. It's fancy. So yeah, I'm going to get some Minecraft stuff started, and this is this is fun. Um, yeah, and then I can hold this to select Vein Miner, and if I hold that while mining a tree, I'll get all the logs. Well, four logs, because that's how much I have it upgraded. So, what we're going to end up doing probably in this first episode is... Killing that dragon. Because that's important in this mod pack. You have to kill the ender dragon because you have to get purple before you can... Well, you don't actually have to kill the ender dragon, I guess. But I have to make it to the end and preferably kill the ender dragon. So, because then I can make the thing that actually allows me to start making... Start running vaults. First thing I need, some cobblestone. And yeah, um, I will get back to you once I've actually, you know, done some stuff. It only took forever. And now, we will actually, I'll just create a waypoint here. A village. So that I can get back here whenever I want to. Huh. Now that I've found a village, see? This is beautiful. Huh. This is what the the twerking skill is. It's great. It's a little weird, but huh. I mean it's great. So I can just huh. this quark lets you just right click on it. Yeah, take your carrots, buddy. And a waystone. I already found one of those on the way here, and I can't use them because I haven't unlocked the waystone mod. But they do stack, that's what I was kind of worried about. Mmm, ores galore. So, I'm going to keep killing these guys because I need more, because I'd like more roll. So that I can make more beds, so that defeating the ender dragon is not so difficult. And I'll probably come loot this village later because currently my inventory is a mess. And Dash is super useful for getting out of little spots. I've never seen this house before. <gasps> wow! This is interesting. Hmm. It's a house. Anyway, Hmm, bushes. I'm gonna go find a place to live. So after a little bit of just running around and being like, uh, I decided might as well be near the village. So I think I'm gonna be on this little ridge here. Just chilling here. I'll get rid of this water pool, but I think I'll build something. I think I'm gonna want it to be pretty hollow. It's definitely not gonna be my finished base, but. It'll be something for me to get started with, I think. So, I'm going to get to building that, and I will see you when I do build it, if the game unfreezes. Give it a second. Do -do oh, okay, it's good now. Anyway, let's go. Back in that's my base. Look, it's fully done. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's not done, by the way, in case you couldn't tell. Bye. Also, let me demonstrate the beauty of the skill I unlocked. Ready? All I got to do is this, and I can just right click on it and report. 
and it just harvests it and plants it automatically, so I can just get as many carrots as I want. Forever. And let me show you something that's quite interesting. You, I need. A... I need you. You can pick them up. So I'm gonna be grabbing all these villagers and slapping them in my house. Let's see. So that's a farmer. You, you. These are two just villagers and. There's more villagers. Tell me. Uh. You know, I'm just gonna break this. Uh. I have sugar boxes. Already. That's great. Oh, hi, demon pig. Bye, demon pig. Leave me alone, please. You're scary. Yeah, so. That's useful. I didn't know that. What mod is this one? Immersive engineering. Huh? I'm just to do you. And I keep hearing the hers and hers because they're in my inventory. Yeah, I'm gonna take you two. Thank you. And you two. This isn't weird at all. Yeah, that's nice. So, I'm going to be setting up a little villager stuff. I'm going to take you. I'm going to start taking some stuff. And, oh, you too. Yeah. Um, I will begin this process of villagering. It should be quite simple since I can just care. Oh. Did not mean to do that. Nitwit, you're all that's left. Anyway. I'm going to start working on some villager stuff. Yeah, I mean it. So, I'm going to start with the good news. Um, that, that, that was irrelevant. Totally. Uh, I got a vault rock. So these are what you use, and six diamonds. These are what you use in the, in the portal for the vault to, you have to do some stuff. I don't know, it's complicated. I'll explain it once I actually get the thing, which I have to get purper for. But we had two unfortunate incidents after. Uh, we had one of the zombie raid things. And these guys, I'm trying to get to them, two of these guys to breed down here. But they're, they're not being, that was not, nope. There we are. They're not being very cooperative. They're not breeding. And I don't know why. Because they've had the hearts several times. But they're like, no, I don't want to breed. So, yeah, I'm just going to leave them to do their thing. Maybe find another village, kidnap them. But, yeah. I mean, I can... I got this stuff. I don't... I think that enchantment book won't work. I'm gonna have a little enchantment spot here. And I guess I haven't shown the little... This place. Um, I don't know. It's pretty much just that. Just all the way around. These guys are here, doing their thing. All leveled up. Got my golden carrots, my random suspicious stews. Yeah. And, yeah. So, I need, um, need to do some stuff, you know. Got a bunch of random ores that I have no idea what they do. Should probably actually smelt something, but I don't want to. Yeah, I'm going to make an enchantment table and enchant some stuff, get some gear, do some crap, and um, yeah, I'll see you when that happens. I am back after trips to the nether that involved an amount of deaths that I don't want to specify. These guys got zombified. I think I'm just going to give up on them, complete the game, go find some other villages, but I'll leave them here for now. So now... I've got the stuff. I hope that'll be enough, unless I get really unlucky, and that'll be mad. But, I should be able to... I don't know why I'm looking for the chest. Find the, the stronghold after I get some ender pearls. Let's see, are there... I forget if there's a warp forest nearby. 
I don't have gold stuff on, so I'll get that. There's one way out. There's one out there. That's the fortress. And this is where I killed all the blazes. There's these weird pil pillar things, and they had blaze spawners in them. So yeah, I'm probably gonna go kill some endermen for a while. Stay away from me, pigs. Yeah, once I find the stronghold, I'll be back to you. Stronghold. And I'm nervous because I hear a bunch of mobs. And you know, having iron armor isn't very helpful. And please, nope, nope, that's not what I meant to press. Hi, hi buddy, hi, hi. Please no, hi. Leave me alone. I just want to find the portal room without dying. That would be amazing. Oh, hi. You too? Great. Mm. I don't know where the portal room is. I'm just going to head this direction. I think I found it. On the map. I think on the top right, that might be it. Hopefully. So, yeah, I'm going to get to the portal room, and then I will see you there. Alright. Here I go into the end. With all the stuff I think I need. I'm scared. Oh, I don't have snowballs. That's going to be annoying. I can still do it. My heart's beating like 900 miles an hour right now. I can feel it. What is this? Oh, just more dimensional shard ore. Alright. I'm gonna cut to the part where I actually kill the Ender Dragon, or am actually like. Once I've done all the crystals, then I'll live the rest of it. So, um, down. Now I'm just sitting here um, waiting for this person to. Wow, you're loud. Jeez, pants. Stop, stop it. Um, which one's hitboxes? Yes. Come on. Okay, now let's see if I can set up a bed thing so I can place this bed. That works. Now we wait. Need to craft a couple more beds real quick. Okay, come on, come down here. Be nice. Just come on down. Come on. I just want to blow you up, alright? Just let me blow you up. Yes, come on, come perch. Come on. Ah! Effective. All right, come back on down. Oh no, that's not good. That is not good. That is not good. Please no. Oh, that was a close one. Half a heart. Um, I'm just gonna chill here for a second while this purple mist um, fades away slowly. Want to kill the Ender Dragon? I'm so close. And then all I need is some purper. I think. I don't know. I'll check the recipe later. No, not again. 
Come on. That's not very. That's not a sporting. It's not very sporting of you. I couldn't get the words out. Come on. I can't come kill you. Okay, let's make some more beds. I did it! I win! Mm, that sound is beautiful. Sixty-seven. Also, there's something important I need to grab here. Well, I don't know what that is, but... You know? And I want the dragon egg, so... Um... Yeah, give me that. Thank you. Alright. I'm gonna get the stuff to make the vault altar. And then I will probably sign off for this episode. So, I'll get the stuff and then say goodbye. Right. God of Materials. And we put that there. I flip them around. Let's do that again. And the vault altar we're just gonna stick this wherever the heck the center is close enough and i can mine it fast so okay shove all this stuff back here maybe there we go except i want you all right and then now to demonstrate what the all-powerful vault altar does. I get a vault rock, but I have mined some, and I place it on this, and this is what I have to get to activate it. And I think I have... Do I have enough? I don't know if I have enough end stone to do it right now. I do have a poisonous potato, I think, unless I threw them all out. I threw them all out. Poop. Well, okay. I think... I'll leave you hanging here, and that will be the end of this episode. See ya!